United Launch Alliance, a joint venture between Lockheed Martin and Boeing, finally has a date for its maiden flight of its powerful new Vulcan Centaur rocket. Christmas Eve. I spoke exclusively with CEO Tori Bruno yesterday at the CNBC Technology Executive Council Summit about the mission, which will carry a commercial lunar lander and cremated remains of some people associated with the original Star Trek series. If all goes according to plan, ULA expects to launch, quote, several times in 2024 before ramping to a rate of every other week by the second half of 2025. The company, which recently launched Amazon's first to test Kuiper satellites to orbit, will use Vulcan to fulfill a massive contract with Amazon as it builds its space-based Internet service. It does change the nature of the, our, our business and makes it a lot more balanced. Before, we were probably about 80 percent government. And now with our other commercial work and Amazon Kuiper Constellation, it's about 50-50. And so that's a lot healthier place to be because when one is up, the other's still fine. All of that investment to ramp Vulcan's launch rate over the next few years, though, that'll mean more ability to answer national security needs as well. So according to Bruno, which is in focus as geopolitical tensions, of course, flare.